El Alak, the clot. With the name of Allah, the most gracious, the ever merciful. Recite with the name of your Lord who created all the universe. Who also created human beings from a clot germinating cell. Proclaim, for your Lord is the most benignant. Who taught knowledge by means of the pen. He taught human being what he did not know. Nay, it is not at all as these people think. This human being does indeed indulge in transgression because he thinks himself to be independent of God. O people, surely to your Lord is the ultimate return of you all to be accounted for your deeds. Have you considered the case of one who forbids a servant of God when he prays to his Lord? O people, do you ever consider if he who prays to God follows the right guidance or enjoins guarding against evil, how bad will be the end of that forbidder? Do you also consider if a person, the rejecter of divine commandments, belies them and turns his back upon the truth what his end will be like? Does he not know that Allah indeed observes all? Nay, it will never be as the rejecter desires. If he does not desist from these wicked ways, we shall assuredly seize him and drag him by the forelock, a lying sinful forelock. Then let him call members of his association. We will call our brave defending guards. Nay, he will never succeed in his evil designs. Yield not to him. Rather continue to prostrate yourself before your Lord and draw near to him.